right guys what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a quick video on how to do a basic snapper or bottom fishing rig for uh, offshore uh, what I'm gonna use is some trilene big game 150 pound uh, that is a uh, 1.19 millimeter uh, the 1.2 crimps are a little snug so I go ahead and step up to the uh, 1.3 millimeter crimps. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find my tag end, which there it is, and I'm going to go ahead and take oh, about six inches and go ahead and snip that. All right, for the starting out, I'm going to go ahead and run that through one side back the other way all right with these crimpers uh, they have different sizes listed I'm going to use the 1.0 to 2.0 millimeter uh, one thing that's very important is you have to put the crimp in sideways and crush it down on itself now with mono you don't want to go all the way to the end of the crimp you want it to flare out just a little bit if you uh, go all the way to the end, uh, what that can do is then pinch, the crimp can actually pinch down on your monofilament leader and can cause it to break at that point. So what you want is a slight flare on all of your crimps. Uh, then I'm gonna take, this is a 10 ounce egg weight. Go ahead and slide that on there. Then I'm going to get another double barrel crimp, put that one side on, then I'm going to use a 230 pound Spro swivel and run that back through. Okay. I'm going to come back to the same place I just crimped before and I'm going to do three crimps on these. Uh, these are pretty long crimps, so I want to make sure it has a good grab on it. All right, then we are going to go ahead and do another piece, probably about uh, 10 to 12 inches. It doesn't have to be too long. Go ahead and snip that off. All right, and I'm going to go ahead and put that in one. And then I'm going to come through the other side of that swivel and then back through. I'm going to pull that down to where there's a little eye left. I'm going to grab my crimps and again, I will emphasize this, do not go all the way to the end of the crimp when it comes to crimping monofilament. You do want that little bit of a flare on the ends. All right, and then lastly is going to be our hook. This is a uh, size five circle hook. All right, so we've got the one side. Let me go ahead and come in, and then double it back through my double barrel crimp, and then pull it down. Uh, Go ahead and do my three crimps on that one. One, two, and three. All right, and that is the uh, the basic construction of these. Uh, what I do for my offshore bottom fishing stuff is I'll tie one of these 500 pound break strength snap swivels directly to my line and then if I have one that fouls down and gets scraped up or broken it is really simple to just go ahead and swap it out um, and that is the basic rig 
for bottom fishing. And you can vary the size of your weights dependent on the current and how deep you're fishing. Uh, 10 ounce is probably a little overkill for what I usually do, but uh, I'd rather have a little bit too much weight than not enough. Uh, but hopefully this is helpful uh, for storage. Uh, same thing I do with my, my ready rigs for the jetties and stuff like that. I'll just go ahead and throw these into a Ziploc bag uh, and then toss them in my tackle bag. That way I don't have to worry about them snagging or getting tangled up on anything else. Uh, so anyway, that's going to be it.